to allow your students to reuse the same ID code over and over to meet with you, it's actually quite simple. Right now inside Zoom, I have it so that my default is my camera's off and I can go into my meeting settings right here, start with video, you'll notice that this changes as I click this. But if I go into meeting settings, I can change my personal ID, but I can also adjust some other settings in here and enable waiting room. This helps you keep control on who's taking part in your meeting. So I'm gonna keep that on and I'm gonna make sure that my, my participants are muted when they enter. Join meeting. You can see here as the host, as the teacher who's hosting the meeting, I have the option whether or not to admit the students into my meeting. As a student, you'll send them your meeting ID, they click join, and when they go to sign in, it won't be here right away if they've had to sign out and sign back in, but what you can do is click right here and you're gonna get a, a history. And that number will be inside the history right here. They click on the ID and they say join.